hello guys it's your boy habib educate and today you know this is an interesting conversation between me and a scammer No, the person you know the person whose account they've hacked was akosia blink z so and the one who hacked it after hacking it he named it Karoli. okay so now i was there and the person sent me hi i replied hello and the conversation continued how are you doing i'm good you good but to me i knew this person is a scammer I even told my friend they should watch what I will be doing or I will do to this camera. So he said, good, where are you from? I said, Accra and you? First, I wanted to write Ghana because I knew it was a scammer, but I intentionally wrote Accra. So he said, I'm from US and he said this, he sent this blank, you know, picture and I said, okay. And he wrote, I'm going to create New York City Facebook account. And this person, you can see it's a big illiterate for you. It's good. You will be happy with it, baby. And here is why you should know this person is a scammer. You started calling me baby, though you've posted a, a, a female picture, you know, as the profile. You don't know me so, uh, anywhere. We started chatting right now, just today, and you are calling me baby already. So this person is fake whenever you are trying to fish out these scammers you should know you should be checking out these things so the person wrote baby i will use your phone number and that's one way that they used to hack the only thing they need is your phone number with your phone number they can quickly hack your facebook account and if you're not careful that will also lead them in you know frauding your money in your momo wallet because they've had that number it's that same number that you use to register your momo account so guys alert i even did a video uh, talking about you know december frauding because it's getting to the festive you know season so mostly these fraudsters they are broke and they need more money because they know a lot of people will be doing more redrawals book from bank and the momo wallet so the message continue baby i will use the phone number for it for it they will send you a, a facebook code who will send me that's another question and you send it to me that facebook code so what they will do is they will use my number that i send them and they these same people will send a code to that number so the moment i hit on the code they sent then i've given them access to my account and they are going to hack it then after that try to hack all the people or most of the people that i have in my you know friend list that's how it works so it continues and send it to me now okay i will show you how to open it and you can use it to make more money i will i am serious with it be fast send me your phone number and you see this is another weak point that this fraudster didn't know as i told you he's a big illiterate he doesn't know anything if you are chatting with someone from usa even if he was to be able to convince me at least in the message i should have been seeing something like you know gotcha meaning got uh, got you that's the gotcha g o you know t s h then a he didn't bring that in the message you won't see something like gonna as in i'm gonna you have because it's an american accent that they'll be using mostly in the chat and other stuff this person is typically Ghanaian, a villager for that matter you understand that's what they do and that's the way they hack people so the conversation continues really i said yes i want money and i said okay send me your number that's what he said and even before starting the chat i even told my friend that you know this person he's a froster just look at how i'm gonna chat him and he gonna he gonna ask me off my number they thought i was lying now here is it he said send me your number i said no problem let me check it okay he said yes and i said i'm in a car going to medina here i wanted to trick him and see whether you know he's like an illiterate or he's not that smart but this froster he's been in the game for long so he's a bit smarter i said i'm going to medina so i thought i knew he's a Ghanaian. so i thought he would be like oh maybe he will talk about medina so that i will know this person is in accra here or in ghana here and i said but the network is messing up he said okay and i said where will i get mtn office around i was just tricking him and he said i don't know what you are talking about so here he he's a bit smarter and i continue because they sent me to draw money so i sort of started you know talking about money just to you know pull him and he is uh, he still said sent me your number i said already he said i don't understand 
So, you know, and he say, I don't understand. You know, if you are chatting someone from the state, the person will write, I don't understand. You understand? The person will write, I don't understand. Maybe I didn't get you or like, you understand? Uh -huh, but this one is just a local one. So I write a minute. He said, bye bye. Boom, boom, clat. Yeah. I just want to stress him up. So now I'm going to show you how to, you know, block them after this. Because the moment you block them, Facebook will review or he will go through the account and see if it's an uh, an account that has been hacked. Facebook itself will do its review, check through and also block that account. So from that or with that, you are preventing this person from hacking other people. Okay, so with that, they will just block the account. He himself will not have access to his account. But if you fall prey to him and send him your number, he has hacked this account already and he's going to hack your account also and try to hack all your friends or most of your friends that, you know, are a bit richer. And that's what they've been doing. So now let's move quickly and block this person. So let's hit back. You know, the person's, you know, the person, the owner of the account is Akosua Blink Z. And the person who hugged him, he changed the name to Carol Lee. Can you see that? Yeah. So as he was chatting me, he thought it is uh, the Carol Lee that would pop up. But he never knew it was the Akosia Blinksy. So they will shudder and use or they will pretend to use this white people's name or nice name to lure you. But we ain't going to fall prey to or going to fall uh, into their trap. So guys, as I was saying... I said we are going to block him, right? But blocking is not the right option. We are going to report him first. So when we report him, Facebook is going to review or go through his messages or the chat we chatted and also go through the account. When they see that it is a hacked account, they are going to block and prevent him from Facebook. And with that, he will not be able to block other people. So what we are going to do is let's hit on the account. You can see the account. Then hit on this info icon then hit on this info icon when you hit on the info icon then scroll down there are a lot of options here don't do anything scroll down you can see restrict block and report we are going to report him first after reporting then we'll block him second after blocking him then we'll delete it and with that we are saved within a few days facebook will send you uh, will send you a message that they've reviewed and realized he's a scam or whatever and they've you know worked on it with that you are blessed and other people are saved as well so let's hit report here are a lot of options is it harassment is it suicide is it pretending to be someone yes it is pretending to be someone but don't hit pretending to be someone hit scams because scams you know issues they take it serious so here is the scam issue offers you money to like their post or leave a good review and whatever so just submit it then now the rest of the work will be done by facebook company itself so after i told you we will report them then after reporting they will bring a lot of options you can block the caroli you can see here it appeared as caloury a uh, Ka caroli or carol but the person's name itself they appeared as akosia blink z so what are we going to do now they said thank you we receive your report scam other steps you can take then you can mute let's mute the account then after muting blocking the account too is another one so let's block the account so now we appear at blocking again just hit on it block then the second one say block on facebook we are going to block him totally on facebook so look at that you can see akosia's message and calls will remain blocked you will need to block okay so after reporting they will go through and when they realize this person is a you know big scammer or a hacker then they will block him totally on facebook so let's hit on it block again and with that we are cool to go so you can just go back go back go and hit on it again long press on it and delete it that's the final process and with that we are good i hope this video is informative if you like it kindly leave a comment in the comment section down below have you ever had ex uh, an experience like this before whatever it is leave it in the comment section down below i'm your boy habib educate and i will see you in the next video salam